Good morning. It's Wednesday, January 12th, and this is your Daily Roar. I'm Andres. And I'm Elias. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Do you have previous experience playing a string instrument? Want to learn how to play the violin, viola, cello, or bass? Need a fine arts credit for graduation? Then you belong in orchestra. Course selection for next year's class is right around the corner. So now is a great time to think about joining the orchestra program in the fall. The orchestra program has earned recognition at the state and national level, participates in performances, community service opportunities, and social events throughout the year. Mr. Comrade would love for you to join the Lake Nona Orchestra family for the 2022-2023 school year. Sign up for orchestra today using the QR code here. If you have any questions, feel free to email Mr. Conrad or come by the orchestra room, that's room 829. Today on Declassified, we dive into the world of video production. Video production is a good start to enter the video industry. I recommend taking the class if you're interested. So the thing that I like about TV productions and learning about it is you really do get the freedom to, to learn the art of film. Uh, well, as the teacher will tell you, we don't film anymore. But recording and, you know, making video production. And it can be a lot of fun. For example, this year I got to work on and make a soap opera. And uh, that was a really interesting time. Uh, I definitely figured out how hard it was to make fictional media and... Uh, that you can have a vision in your head, but no matter what that vision is, it's, you know, it, it can be a pretty difficult task to execute in and great fun just to try. If you continue with the course, you'll be allowed the opportunity to be certified in Adobe Premiere Pro, as well as work on Lake Nona's very own Daily Roar. Thanks for watching. Twelve years ago, when our school opened, there wasn't much else out here. Those students didn't have the wonderful businesses and restaurants we have for enjoying a snack after school but the actions of a few is putting that in jeopardy for everyone else. When you enter someone else's business, you are a guest. That means you're responsible for treating their property with respect. When word gets out to businesses that Lake Nona students don't respect private property, then more places may restrict our access. If you feel like you can't act responsibly, then don't go in and don't ruin it for the rest of us. What's wrong with this video? There are a few restrooms on campus which are off limits to students. The doors are clearly marked that they're just because the door isn't locked doesn't mean that it's okay to use. There are a few restrooms on campus which are off limits to students. The doors are clearly marked and just because the door isn't locked doesn't mean it's okay to use. I'm Andres. And I'm Elias. The difference between school and life? In school, you're taught a lesson and then given a test. In life, you're given a test that teaches you a lesson. See you right here tomorrow.